head teacher of Kingfisher Hall. I feel very, very privileged. <laughs> We've got very dedicated staff, lovely children, an amazing environment to learn. I love working at this school. I think it's it's just a really good school and a really good trust to work for. It's calm, it's friendly. That's a bright angle because it goes like that. I love it. I absolutely love my role. Uh, the kids are fantastic, fun, energetic. They've always got smiles on their faces, they're happy to come to school. I learn so much from them every day. They are hilarious. Um, I've turned into a big kid. What do you think they do with their bugs that they capture? It's so amazing coming in every day and seeing how much joy they bring to my job, to the day, how excited they are to learn. They're always engaged, they're always happy. They understand the impact that education can make in their life. So it's a pleasure, it's a joy. That's why we do it. We do it because of that enthusiasm. It's contagious, really. At Kingfisher Hall, we're very lucky to have our own nursery. Um, we welcome children in from the age of three. And I was drinking. <laughs> we pride ourselves on saying, you know, we're the beginning of their education. So we need to make a really solid foundation for them. A fun environment, a safe environment, a nurturing environment. What is happening in your story? I think what the kids really like is kind of interacting with them and getting involved in their play and being just one of them. You know, some cookies there? Yes. Well done. We are an inquiry-based environment. We have an indoor and outdoor classroom. Children learn inside and outside. We are digging in the ground to look for mini bees. We are also reading stories, using our imagination all the time. We're singing. I think it's a really big step for them to come into nursery. So I think we work in close partnership with the parents and then we take them through step by step as we do with the children. And look at the gingerbread man, what is he doing now? The staff are very skilled and able um, to make sure they're delivering the curriculum. We have a school driver of force a positive change and that is something that we're really trying to embed this year to make sure that our kids know that they have a voice and that they can make a difference. Force for positive change is the heart of Kim Fisher. It's a really exciting and engaging way of delivering the curriculum. The bear is a strife, it's our mascot, it's been named by the children and also the logo is it's been made by the children. The force of positive change driver makes them also believe that they can do whatever they, they, they want to do and they can achieve and that learning is lifelong and this is the great foundation for them in primary school here. Reading is fundamental across the whole curriculum. Yes, you did. Okay, next page for me. Not only do we give children the fundamental skills that they need, kind of the, the comprehension and that word reading and that word understanding, but also uh, foster a love of reading so that they end up becoming lifelong readers. I will promise anything you like. It really is the driver for our school really are passionate about making sure every child learns to read but at a good standard. And show me your fingers. And the children love it. They love the picture side, they love learning the sounds and the phrases. Let's see your right hand go. Maths is everywhere. Maths is pretty much everything that we look at, everything that we do. And so it's about giving them the confidence to be able to go forward and be independent learners and to conquer the world because they know how to navigate the spaces, they know how to count their money, they know how to measure. Basically, it's basic life skills. This is the right angle. The curriculum at Kingfisher Hall, we try and do it within learning journeys. So where we can make cross-curricular links, we pull subjects together. So we've got music specialist teachers, Spanish specialist teacher, and this year we're lucky to have the addition of a PE coach. Nice. PE in general, the kids are really enthusiastic about it. They always love to come out and do it. We need to make sure they're as active as possible at all times. It's going to help them, especially when they're going into the classroom, getting them focused on their work as well. In my role at North Star Community Trust, it's important that I ensure that we have the best teachers available and the best resources available to our children to ensure that from cradle to career, they achieve their potential. 
The community outreach team deliver a number of free courses. They're around health and wellbeing, education, any areas that uh, parents may feel they need support, especially if they're a first time parent bringing their child into school. We also partner with a lot of local organisations that come in and will deliver accredited training so our parents will end up with a certificate at the end, which enable them to move on to employment. Those nouns. Your voice is heard, whether you're a teacher, whether you're um, a TA, whether you're a pupil. I just feel like it's a real kind of collaborative um, atmosphere to be in. We are family. Every single teacher, we have very good and positive relationships and we are aware that we are role models. Mother, Holly, Mother. write it down, fantastic. I just want every single child just to be able to reach whatever their goals are that they set for themselves to not limit them, not cap them, and then for them to be able to just be successful wherever they go. I would encourage you to come and visit Kingfisher Hall Academy and experience for yourselves our excellent school. We work incredibly hard to make sure all children are successful, but also that they have developed in their personal relationships and that they're ready for their next steps in life.